section of down to earth we have some very interesting facts the first is vengurla it is a town in sindhudurg district in maharashtra which has enforced 100% waste segregation at source through the 1200 uh, 12400 households uh, nearly 300 tons of waste is uh now present and has been changed uh, we are also talking about biodegradable waste being generated from the processing facility vermi composting and uh, also the uh, biomethanization plant has been established gps tracking system has been done and rfid uh, have been used for real time update for uh, status of collection of the waste so those are some of the important developments uh, in line of the venagurla then we have blue hydrogen green hydrogen pink hydrogen in yellow hydrogen the concept is extremely important obtained by electrolysis of water uh, separating into hydrogen and oxygen uh, this is used in various forms so green hydrogen is from renewables blue hydrogen is from natural gas we have uh, the various other forms of yellow hydrogen from fossil fuels pink hydrogen from nuclear power and they have been used significantly so here we have how much methane is expelled by the natural and the other sources wetlands fossil fuels are the highest proportions through which we have the methane being uh, removed being uh, ex uh, exhaled into the atmosphere being brought into the atmosphere now uh, most of the wildfires have happened in of africa wildfire rates have increased significantly in the recent areas and animals and plants are at a high risk because of the climate change induced disruptions with unseasonal rain and extreme temperature conditions ukraine and russia conflict has brought a significant change in the economic with rising energy prices uh, shifting focus from conventional sources and conventional energy to renewable energy and we are also focusing now on climate finance to developing countries and related talks uh, farm equipments and renovation in those equipments is important now bullocks uh, bullocks are widely used for weeding and sowing instrument which is locally made vinin kala is a seed pipe for sowing we have similar developments which are seen by various uh, groups from andhra pradesh sangra village watershed support services and activity network has been established this has been popularizing the use of bullock carts in the regions of shrikakulam east godavari and veninsgaram uh, then we are also talking about how many bullocks have been employed as draught animals so far only 20% utilization is done for their power which is Okay, which can be increased up to forty four percent, and also the average potential so far is less than one hour. We can rise up to five hours a day in the coming scenario. We are also seeing that this promotion would increase organic farming and the growth and the development related to that. The next is the coal mining. Uh, the Harsinga Deuchi Panchami block is one of the largest coal block of the West Bengal official site, and we have seen that how government owned coal mining and refining contributes to eighty percent of the total coal. production in india the blocks have been seen across six states uh, different states which are there and new jobs have been generated across it uh, we are also identifying land projects that are owned by people and those which belong to the state government the remaining under the hand of the forest land and how these boundaries are important what are the trees and the vegetation which are seen here so the challenge for uh, the mining is important the depth of the coal block the correct mining method so that we can go more, much more deeper open cast mining can go up to 300 meters and then we need to have underground mining beyond 3 uh, 600 meters also we need to understand that what is the ideal depth of the overburden the space between the top soil and the coal reservoir and then uh, the overburden depth of the coal block other than the uh, basaltic and the volcanic rock needs to be understood so devan gaza moza in kolkata is important and here residents have been growing paddy pulses and veg vegetables animal husbandry is another method which is being used uh, the most important thing as we said is the top layer is the top soil and the coal reservoir which is thin alluvial then you have the hard basaltic or the volcanic origin rock which is seen and therefore the hard crust is gone through bl blasting or explosion uh, then we see the coal seams up to nearly 80 meters uh, which are ideal for mining 
then the maximum depth up to 850 meters which can go uh, so there are various ways through which we understand anything about g10 which is the average age of the coal with high ash content and low calorific value is used for power generation g3 and below is used for specialized industries like steel making so the quality of coal is again important and uh, in this process there are lots and lots of uh, townships which are being uh, made because people have been dis people have been displaced from Birham's Bakeshwar township, uh, people are still talking about compensation to be received and an assured job in police for one member from each household family. Anti-hail cannons are being devised indigenously now. Now this cannon is important. Uh, the cannon actually protects the damage to the apple trees and the apples in the months of their ripening. So what happens during the hail? Uh, this cannon actually blasts short uh, sound waves and this heat up the cloud and prevent the formation of the hail so as you can see in this diagram uh, LPG is now used in a denotation tube and this converts that the heat is converted into sound wave and through the divergent uh, duct it goes up into the atmosphere at a speed of 700 to 1000 meter per second up to 5 to 6 kilometers high and the sound waves blast 5 to uh, 4 to 5 seconds for 20 minutes and this prevents prevents the formation of hail storm previously the imported ones were using acetylene now we are creating our indigenous ones which can actually use uh, lpg and can be more cost effective so we are uh, working with various uh, institutions like uh, iit bombay university of horticulture and forestry solan himachal pradesh to develop the indigenous cannon the next is james webb space telescope which has been developed in a period of 30 years costing nearly 10 billion dollars of U uh, US. Uh, this has been named after the second administrator James Webb uh, based on infrared and it could see back to nearly 13.5 billion years uh, time and it can examine the evolution and the formation of galaxies and solar system. It can decode issues related to dark matter and dark energy. The India's expenditure has been very very high in terms of healthcare but most of that is out of pocket so average Indian spends nearly 2000 per uh, year on health expense and out of expense uh, expenditure was nearly 55%. Household paid nearly 61% of the current health spendings in India which is a significantly high number. The statistics would be available in the handouts you can simply check that. The next important thing is with the rising diseases, we need treatment and vaccination. COVID-19 has weakened the public health care system. WHO is facing a funding gap of nearly $900 million uh, in the last one year gap and they have we have to be prepared for various emergency. Now, TB report says that there has been a reverse global progress in tra tackling TB which has been witnessed. The current scenario says that for cholera nearly 3, uh, 1 to 4 million cases are there of which uh, 21,000 to 1 1.5 like deaths are, deaths are witnessed. So, routine hand washing, open defecation uh, are some of the things that need to be addressed. Then is uh, the policy for the same to reduce the death by 90%. For Big losses are yearly caseload is nearly 10 million with a death of nearly 1.5 million. Clean air ventilation reforms in household are important. Similarly, for the measles, we have a similar figure which is witnessed. Behavioral change is required, especially uh, for the vulnerable group which is pregnant women, females and infants. We also require um, uh, strategies to curb the resurgence of such diseases. Influenza, again 1 billion yearly cases with 1.5 million deaths. Uh, Isolation, quarantine, uh, limited public gathering are some of the methods that must be adopted. Uh, HIV, again, uh, we have a huge number of death toll with nearly 8.6 lakh deaths. And a UN program to, has been established, which is UN AIDS in 1994, for uh, creating awareness. We have COVID-19, uh, nearly 4 24 million cases with 5 million deaths. Masking, social distancing and remote work or virtual work was introduced as a policy major. Uh, then South Africa has been working for advancement in the doses of vaccination and various technologies related to the same. Uh, we have biological gold mine. Now this is one of the important studies which is done in the uh, Ahmedabad Spirana wastewater treatment plant in the first wave of the pandemic which found samples from the sewage and it said that the remains of protein, undigested fiber, salt uh, and cells from intestinal lining uh, constitute 75% uh, of the total 
thing and nearly 20 to 25 percent is the organic matter which com comprises of microbes and this are very very important so uh, gut uh, activity or microbial activity are extremely important to understand so uh, that's something that we need to understand here so as you can see there are various uh, biomarkers that are given here and important biomarkers for which condition so for ulcerative colitis it is biofridium bi uh, bifidum and so on then machine learning can be deployed to study the fecal sample and understand uh, the concept uh, how we can analyze those and develop a system to understand hyaluron is a carbohydrate molecule which is secreted either by vascular diseases or diabetes and is identified by nanotechnology to understand extracellular vesicles similarly uh, for rocket engines so far india is using solar power now we are moving towards a new technology which is radio isotope thermoelectric generators and they are being powering a spacecraft solar uh, energy could be used only in the well lit areas but there was an instance where we have seen that uh, the spacecraft actually accidentally landed on the dark side and it was not able to provide sufficient data so with this technology of RTGS, we have longer lifespan, refueling and recharging is not a concern. There is no operational range of anxiety which can be seen and therefore it is much more uh, probably uh, possibly used. Uh, the transit navigation satellite failed to launch and burned on re-entry in the North Madagascar. It ejected plutonium fuel. However, uh, the RTG, uh, the radioactive particles can uh, not escape from the RTGS because they are under a radiation proof shield and that's one of the ways that they are saying that it is much more uh, safer. We are now using kerosene, hydrogen, alcohol and derivatives with liquid, uh, liquid hydrogen as fuel rocket or propellants. Nuclear propellants are twice more effective than their counterparts and therefore this is a new method that could be used. Make it that to dam project is important. Now it is being built by, it is being pro uh, proposed by Karnataka and this is in a geologically unstable region it is located in the downstream of the Krishnarath Sagar Dam and where it's a kind of plateau like uh, topography as you can see and uh, this is where we have uh, the point where the flow of the river is across these regions and there is uncertainty with the epicenter of major earthquakes which can be seen so it can make the region technologically uh, unstable geologically un uh, uh, affected in this region then the Bangalore case study again it is important to assess the water sources and the viable options for expanding rainwater harvesting has been done pastoralism is another practice that is being practiced even today uh, this is an economic activity for nearly 100 to 200 million people worldwide with nearly 13 million people in india one fourth of the planet's surface is devoted for pastoral activities it is highly climate resilient and adaptive even in the harsh climatic uh, conditions when the resources are scarce there can be ways that could be brought about and pastoralism can actually thrive around the cropping system as they benefit each other uh, and they are a good way however the modern systems have been rejecting pastoralism grazing is considered as a threat and an impact on foresting activities uh, the next is developing national legal and policy framework for uh, pastoral mobility now this has been released by unfo fao and there has been documents that pastoralists are considering backward looking uh, they are being considered as backward looking or unproductive historically there have been legislatures for it but uh, pastoralists are vulnerable to resource appropriation sedentary lifestyles and uh, restricted mobility and they are squeezed out now from the productive areas so what can be done is for the pastoral systems we need to have more protein output per field uh, so to make it much more intensive 70 percent of our total meat output and 50 percent of the milk output comes from uh, the pastoral systems and the related activity the next is fukushima water fukushima water uh, waste disposal now the waste is so far being collected into tanks there are more than 100,000 tanks which have stored this uh, radioactive waste but now they are trying to uh, clean this and dump it however except for tritium all other radioactive material can be treated but this tritium has a possibility to increase the risk of cancer 
and therefore criticism for the safety has been raised up uh, the next some important other news are in the region of 24 south perganas uh, in west bengal we have seen that uh, cyclones have become very very common and have been affecting the region uh, badly in spain the draft bill on animal rights have uh, come up which includes a ban on the sale of pets and conversion of zoos into wildlife recovery centers uh, in africa cases of wild polio virus have been witnessed uh, we are also talking about the heaviest rainfalls in brazil uh, where numerous people have died and this was one of the heaviest rainfalls since 1932 uh, maharashtra is on high alert because of bird flu there are various anganwadis which are on strike because of uh, the uh, the the pay issues and job regularization issues uh, the duty on palm oil has been reduced from 8.25 to 5.5 which is again a significant development which we have witnessed so those are some of the important coverage that we have done in the down to earth edition stay tuned for many updates on our uh, from our side and definitely for upsc prelims we are now bringing in mock papers which are available on door step tutor so just practice the mock questions before you go for your exam Wish you very good luck. Thank you.